Breakfast is super delicious. I'm so full. Thank you. Actually, you want to say something? Yes, please. Well, you want to be an actress. Actually, I'm very good at it. Oh, okay. But suddenly, why? You still want to be famous. <laughs> why are you laughing? No worries. I know a famous film writer and director. I will talk to him and ask him to write a script for you. Really? Thank you, babe. So who will play your hero? Definitely not you. Really? Then who? Ki <laughs> Erika, how are you? I am fine, how are you my friend? Fine as well. Actually I'm here to ask you something. Yes, please ask. Actually you want to be an actress and I'm going to shoot a film and I need your husband to be my hero. <laughs> this is amazing, why not? He will be so happy to work with you, he also wants to be an actor. Really? Thanks my friend. Hey babe I have a something for you. Okay, what is that? So you wanted to be an actor, right? Yes, this is my dream. Your dream is about to come true. Are you sure? How is this gonna happen? Our neighbor Claire is going to work in a film and she wants you to be her hero. Oh my goodness, this is absolutely amazing. Yes, you will become famous. You know what I want to be in the movie as well. Don't worry. We all work together. Let me talk to Jose. We will need a perfect director for us. I think you are right. We should work together in a movie. But we need a better story writer and director for a better movie. Don't you think so? Let me think if I know someone. Yes, I know someone who can write a love story for us, and he can direct the movie as well. You also know him. Are you talking about Mr. Patrick? Absolutely right. We will talk with Mr. Patrick to write a story for us. Yes, I know he's good story writer, but he's little crazy human, and you know it. Don't worry about that. We just need a simple script from him. Okay, let's meet him. Hi Mr. Patrick, how are you? Hello my friend, what are you doing here? Mr. Patrick, actually I need your help. Yes please, tell me what can I do for you? Mr. Patrick, me and my wife wants to work on a film, so can you please write a love story for us, we will be very thankful. That's it, it's a peanut for me, now don't worry, your script will be ready tonight. I'm the king of story writers. Thank you so much Mr. Patrick. Enough time left, time to take quick nap. Thank God, he says yes to the script, now we will be working together in a movie, very excited. Yes, he said he is getting our script ready tonight. Wow, that's quick, Mr. Patrick is super talented I guess. Don't you think this is too quick for a script writing? Oh come on Josh, it's his thing, our job is to get the things done. Can't wait until tonight, our script will be ready. Absolutely right. It was nice sleep. Hey, I have a story to write. I think I heard something. 
What was that sound? Well, time to write a story. Oh my lucky chair, it's time to add another story together. Once upon a time, a couple was born. Who, who are you? Once upon a time, there is a horror film director who would let on this chair. Tan ten. Hey Josh, I think our script must be ready, what do you think? I hope so, I have a little doubt on Mr. Patrick but let's see. Come on Josh, I have full trust on Mr. Patrick. Let's go to Mr. Patrick's house. Okay let's go. Hi Mr. Patrick. What happened Mr. Patrick, is the script ready? Your script is ready. Follow me. What happened to your voice, Mr. Patrick? He said, follow me. Okay, Mr. Patrick. <coughs> Mr. Patrick, what is this place, and why you bring me here? He am not my Patrick. What are you talking, Mr. Patrick? Who are you? Run! <laughs> are you sure about that? He was not Mr. Patrick. Trust me Jose, he was not Mr. Patrick. Even his voice was different. Really, I think something definitely wrong. I told him to read the script but instead he started reading horror stories. I was confused and scared. This is really crazy man. I'm more worried about my wife. She wanted to be an actress but how will I tell her about this? Her heart will be broken. Don't worry, it's okay, she will understand the situation for sure. But first of all, we have to solve this unknown mystery. I know a person who can help us. Really, who? Baba Skeleton. Hey kid, how can I help you? Baba Skeleton, thank you for helping me out, actually we are in trouble somewhere outside. Don't worry, tell me the problem man. Actually we were trying to shot a film and so we wanted a script, and we told someone to write a script but when we reach out to him for our script, we saw him in some horror spirits, now please help us from him. Oh I see, wait a minute. Let me see who is behind it. I got it, as I'm seeing. The guys who wrote your script is Mr. Patrick, right? How did you know that? But the person who wrote your script is not Mr. Patrick. He is someone else. Really? But who was he? He was Corey Parker, the horror film director, a film director who got killed in a chair present in Mr. Patrick's library, and now whoever sits on that chair, he will become different person. Oh my god, it means it was Corey Parker's soul in Mr. Patrick's body. Yes exactly. And that's why he wrote horror story instead of love story. Okay so this is the problem. So how to deal with this? There is only one solution, you guys have to burn the chair. Okay, so we have to burn Mr. Patrick's library chair. Will it work? This is the only solution kid, do this, and save yourself and your people. Thank you so much Baba Skeleton. Oh Michael, are you serious? Yes Claire, this is what happened behind all this. I'm really sorry for this. Don't feel sorry Jose, I can understand this. Thank for the understanding Claire. 
You are the best. What? Is this true? Oh my god. I'm glad you all are safe. Yes Erica. This is exactly what happened behind all these. We were supposed to work on a film but sadly it's not happening. I tried, I'm sorry. It's okay Zosh. I can understand. This must be hard to put all this together when things don't go our way. At least you tried well. We will walk some other day. I'm very proud of you. Thank you for your understanding. But the ending is still left. We went to a barber for the help. He gave us the solution. We have to do this before tomorrow morning. Please take care while doing this. Okay Claire. The final ending is still left. We have to end this before tomorrow morning. Stay home. I'll be back soon. Please take care of yourself. Hurry up Josh, we have to burn the chair. Yes, let's do this as soon as possible. Hurry up Jose, let's burn this chair. What to do now Jose? Josh look at that. Yo got it. Yes. Ready. <coughs> Finally we have done it. Finally. <laughs> Thank God it's over. It was terrible night. I was so scared. Yes, it was crazy night, but thank God, everything is good. Man, what a crazy night it was. A night to forget forever. Yes man, super crazy. But the good thing is, it's all ended well. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha